news. Today's Bear News is brought to you by the Huffington Post because everything else was rubbish and tea. We'll get into Bear News of today because there is there's a few things with Bear News. It's there's quite a lot of animal related ones because the news was stupid today. But I'll get into them because there's quite a lot of words here that I can't pronounce properly, but I'm going to give it a go. The first one is jellyfish forced the closure of the Ashkarish, according to Google Translate, that's how you say it, uh, Swedish reactor. Uh, basically, the moon jellyfish, there's loads of them in Swedish waters, and they swam into the pipes of the nuclear reactor, and because the nuclear reactors need a huge intake of water to keep the reactor cool, um, the jellyfish clogged it up and they had to shut it down, which is... Not uncommon, apparently. This happens quite frequently. It happens at most of the reactors. There's one in California that happened in last year. And it's it's kind of, they say it's similar to when, what happens when a tsunami hits because basically it takes all the water away, which is kind of what happened with Fukushima in 2011. Although that was not jellyfish, that was actually a tsunami. So, yeah. Jellyfish were wrecking some shit. Because they're jellyfish. <laughs> Fair news. Um, next. Uh, don't play golf in Verbier, Switzerland. Verbier, Verbier. That place in Switzerland the, with the V name. <laughs> because a fox will run off with your balls. Yeah. So, beware. Fair news. Um, oh, if you've ever wondered if you've got tobesity, don't, you weirdo. Uh, because there is now a plastic surgery treatment to remove the fat from your feet. Because you might have tobesity. That's the stupidest thing I've ever heard. Toes getting, what? Wait, what? Toes do not get fat, do they? Is that a thing? Do toes get fat? Okay, so bear news to vain feet people, I guess. 23 goats were stolen using duct tape. This actually happened. Duct tape. Basically, um, more than 20 goats, some of which were pregnant. I don't know why that's important. But some of which were pregnant were stolen from Kahuku goats in Oahu on Thursday night. And they were valued at like $10,000. But what happened was, is the thieves came along and they duct taped around their mates to stop them making noise and stole, stole some goats. Um, I think the moral of this story is keep an eye on your goats, I guess. I don't know. that Duct tape? Okay. That's a thing. Oh! Forget about Sharknado! This is sheep potato. I can't remember what the the tag of the thing was. But basically, I'm going to put a picture here on the screen in a minute. And then we'll talk about it in a second. It's a fucking potato! It's in the shape of a sheep! It totally looks like a sheep! It's amazing! Burners. Potato sheep. I bet it's tasty. And lastly, in. Oh, also, we've got no Liberty Bear this week. She's on a bender somewhere. He. Uh, with the cameraman. Why not? Sure. Um, hopefully. She, he will make an appearance at some point uh, and stop leaving all the news to me. Fucking diva. Okay, onwards. Onwards to the news. This is, this is, the, this was the title of the news report. Uh, Sex on railroad tracks turns tragic. Well, duh. In Zaporizhia, Ukraine, some couple 
couldn't hold their passion in any longer. They wanted to feel the exhilaration of having sex near train tracks. And it went horribly wrong. Um, she shuffled off this mortal coil and he has no legs now. Um, because don't play with trains, kids. It's bad. Fair news. Okay, so that is this week's fair news. It's a day late because I was sick and exhausted from the Dublin International Comedy Expo yesterday and totally forgot. Um, so there you go. Okay. Bye guys.